mythical sensor is the material needed for attempting mythical art doing it. Here is a recipe for manufacturing mythical sensor. Some of these materials are available in the central market. First material, 10 powder of flame. You can get this by mining a gathering life scale and worker node. Here is a list where you can put some workers. Or you can just buy it on the central market. Second material is 10 fire horn. You can get this by hunting life skill, or you can just also buy it on the central market. Third, 10 mythical feather. A very low chance to drop from primitive, lush primitive, old and lush old Lakairo sacks. You can also get this by exchanging fairies to heroin at the Camisilv temple. Tier 3 and 4 only. Tier 3 fairy equals 1 mythical feather. Tier 4 fairy equals 2 mythical feather. You can purchase this in the central market at 20 million silver. Since this is kind of rare, it is advisable to pre-order it ahead of time. Fourth material, old moon sensor. You can get this by manufacturing. Materials needed are 100 pure copper crystal, 100 pure tin crystal, 100 pure platinum crystal, 100 moonlight opal and 1 old moon sensor mold. Pure copper crystal can be created by heating 2 metal solvent and 3 copper ingot. Pure tin crystal can be created by heating 2 metal solvent and 3 tin ingot. Pure platinum crystal can be created by heating 2 metal solvent and 3 platinum ingot. Moonlight opal can be created by heating 1 metal solvent and 3 brilliant opal. Since I don't want to go to the hassle of crafting pure copper crystal, pure tin crystal, pure platinum crystal and moonlight opal. I just bought it all from the central market. Old Moon Sensor Mold can be purchased in any Old Moon Manager of Main Town. After acquiring all the materials you can now manufacture it. Fifth and last material, 10 mythical powder. You can get this by grinding 10 black stone powder, 10 fruit of enchantment, 10 everlasting herb, 10 flower of oblivion and 10 royal fern root. Black stone powder can be created by grinding black stone. Fruit of enchantment can be acquired by gathering herb, fruits, vegetables, and mushroom. Can also get from farming by breeding of herbs or grass on a rare chance of drop. Everlasting herb can be acquired by breeding crops and gathering using hoe. Flower of Oblivion can be obtained from Imperial Horse Delivery. Depending on the horse tier on how many Flower of Oblivion you can get. Here is the chart. The horse should be level 15 to Imperial Trade. If you are not into horse training, you can just buy any level 15 horse in the horse market. Flower of Oblivion is not marketable, so this is the only way you can get it. Lastly the Royal Fern Root. This is the backlog for this material, since you can only get this on a daily and weekly quest. You need 100 Royal Fern Root. For a weekly quest, you can get 30 PCS of Royal Fern Roots, by just capturing any tier of horse, and for the daily quest, it will vary depending on the level of your training. Beginner and Apprentice 1 piece, Skilled and Professional 2 pieces, Artisan 3 pieces, Master 4 pieces and Guru 5 pieces. You cannot get both quests at the same time. You can get the daily quest after you finish the weekly quest. Weekly quest cooldown will start after you finish the quest.
Here are the locations of horses near Stonetail Horse Ranch. You can change server if you don't find the horse that you are looking for, especially for daily quests. I also put the link of the website for the horse appearance per tier, so you can know what is the tier of the horse based on its appearance. To capture the horse you just need a capturing rope and lump of raw sugar. You can buy capturing rope in the stable and cook a lump of raw sugar, or you can just buy both of it in the central market. It is better to put the capturing rope and lump of raw sugar in your shortcut keys. Once you see the horse, don't go near it because you will scare it away. Now use the capturing rope slowly come near the horse, and if you see the cursor change you can now start capturing it. Left click to start the minigame. Make the yellow moving bar into the blue bar guide. When the horse starts raising his front feet be ready to click your space bar multiple times. For 10 seconds the red bar should be greater than the blue bar. Once finished start moving forward and if it raises its feet again start pressing the space bar again, then move forward again. Then if you are close enough you can now feed him some lump of raw sugar, two or three are enough. Then R to write it. Once you captured it successfully you can now go back to the stable keeper to register the horse. No need to ride the horse going back to the stable keeper. You can go back to your main horse, and the newly captured horse will just follow you. The higher your training mastery the higher chance of capturing the horse. Then you can now grind the material needed for mythical powder. Once you have all the materials you just go to the processing window then manufacture. Then you have it. Thank you for watching and bye.